Hey everyone, Josh here with Ruby the Rubicon and this is a little bit of a different video for us. When we were out last weekend exploring the tracks around Nunes, the Lost City, uh, Blackfellow Hands Trail and the Glowworm Tunnels, when we were on the way out we came across a bloke that needed a little bit of help. Now I'm not going to make any judgment about how the bloke got to be in this position because I can see myself doing something dumb like this too. Um, the funny thing is, it wasn't actually his truck. He was driving his girlfriend's car and got it stuck. And when we rocked up, there were a bunch of guys with uh, on motorbikes with long, long sticks trying to lever the vehicle over the top. The president of the central west 4x4 club is matt he also runs uh, opposite lock which is the four wheel drive store one of the four wheel drive stores here in town and as soon as matt spotted it matt just jumped on the radio and said to the group look we're going to stop we're going to give this guy help out but um yeah so credit goes to matt for pulling up and giving these guys a hand down off the situation that they got themselves in so we've been pottering around and we've just spotted this <laughs> Opposite lock to the rescue. What I'll do is um, I'll, uh, I'll just winch you forward a little bit and just and then if you don't roll down I'll get out of your way and I'll hook the road and if you just winch so your back wheels in the middle of the belly's not stuck here. You did say you were going to do a winching demo. So as you can see, um, <laughs> ambitions in this case outstripped the ability of the vehicle. Basically the, the mound that he went up on was shaped like that. So it was fairly shallow on one side and fairly steep on the other. And he's come across the top of it and just gotten the vehicle stuck. Just not enough ground clearance. As I said, exactly the kind of silly thing I could see myself doing. Fortunately, we were able to help him out, got him up, down off the mound. And his girlfriend walked up and said, well, it's actually my car. So, yeah, bit of a funny one. But as I said, props to Matt uh, for, for stopping and helping and um, you know, giving us a little demonstration of what is a, a, a good trail etiquette. So, as always, if you're enjoying our content, please do like, subscribe, share the videos, enable notifications so that you get updates when new videos are posted. And this has been Josh with Ruby the Rubicon. Thanks for watching. Cheers.